Hi, in this video, we'll explain three ways by which you might update your Linux kernel to the latest available version. So without any further ado, let's get started. The Linux kernel is the core of the Linux operating system. It is responsible for interfacing the computer hardware and software applications in this operating system. Like the continual updates to Linux operating system and applications, new versions of Linux kernel will also be released. It is recommended to update the kernel version to have the latest functionalities, improved stability and secure fixes. Before updating the kernel version, it is better to check the current version. It will help you to decide which new version to update the kernel to. So, in order to check the current kernel version directly from the command line, run this command. As we can see, the kernel version of our operating system is 5.4.0-40 generic. So in our first method, we will update the kernel version by first downloading the latest version from the Ubuntu kernel team site. So open up the Ubuntu kernel team site to download the latest version. Let's say we want to use 5.6.10. Select the version and download these three files. Once all packages are downloaded, you can verify them using ls-l command. The download files might be in the downloads folder, so change directly to the downloads. Now, station. All right. The next step is to install all the downloaded packages. So now, install all the downloaded .deb files. You can do this using this command. Wait for a while until installation of all packages is complete. Alright, installation is complete. Now reboot your system. Once the reboot is complete, open up your terminal and check the kernel version again. The output has shown us that the updated kernel version is 5.6.10. Alright, now in our next method using the bash script, we'll use bash script in order to install a new kernel version. So first of all, download the bash script using the command wget and I'll actually copy and paste the link to which you can found in the article below. All right, now copy the script to the slash user slash local slash bin directory. Now you can update the kernel version using this command. Oops, I made a spelling mistake in the kernel. It's EL. I'm sorry for that. Yes. Now it will search for and provide you with the latest kernel version. Once installed, reboot the system again. Alright, now let's move to our next method, update Ubuntu kernel version using GUI. In this method, we'll discuss the GUI method to update the Linux kernel. We will use the graphical mainline tool for installing the latest version of the kernel. So first of all, the mainline tool is not available in official Ubuntu repository. So we will need to manually add its PPA to the sources.list file in our system. Use the apt-add-repository command for this purpose. Once we have added the mainline repository, now update the system's repository index. And now install the mainline tool with this command. Alright, now launch the mainline tool from the Ubuntu search bar.
When the mainline tool is launched, you will see an installer window with a list of a new and available kernel versions. You may install a new version by selecting the version from the list and click the install button on the bar to the right. The installation of the selected kernel version is started. Now reboot your system and then verify the new kernel version. Alright? Now open up the terminal and check the kernel version. I have used 5.6.1 no in the first method deliberately so that we can verify that other methods work. So in this video we have explained three different methods to update the kernel version on Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. After updating the kernel, sometimes you may face issue in booting the system. In that case, switch back to the old kernel by hitting the shift key at the port and select the older version from the list. So I hope this video helps a lot in checking and updating the Ubuntu kernel version. So keep on learning with Linux Mint. Oh,